Hey y'all, welcome back. Today I'm going to do my April favorites and we can just go ahead and get started. Uh, the first thing I have is a facial product which is the St. Ives Even and Bright Pink Lemon in Mandarin Orange Scrub. It polishes away little imperfections and for a bright radiant skin and it is the moderate exfoliant factor and it's like a pink tone. It almost feels like if you were to wet baking soda that's what it feels like. Um, and it smells so good and it makes my skin feel so soft and it gets all the rid of the dead skin and I have really been enjoying this. The next two things are a shampoo and conditioner which I've showed you guys before but since I have my hair um, different um, I went back to, I went back to using this which is the organics renewing argan oil in Morocco uh, shampoo and conditioner which is these two blue bottles with the gold tops and they smell so good and they are sulfate free which um, sulfates uh, fade away the red burgundy and uh, purple colors um, so this is my favorite shampoo and conditioner of all time and I also ended up uh, picking my macadamia hair mask back up and I can just, this is a miracle worker. This makes my hair so healthy, shiny, and it makes it smell so good. There's not even enough good things to say about this product. And I will continue to repurchase this because it is a necessity for my hair. And I absolutely, I just love this mask. Um, the next two things are these Maybelline eyeshadow quads, the Eye Studio, and I've never had one of these before, and now I see what the hype is all about because these seriously are the best drugstore eyeshadows ever. They are so creamy and so pigmented, it reminds me so much of a high-end eyeshadow. The two, um, uh things I have are 70 Copper Chic and 05 Give Me Gold and this is what they look like they are so creamy this is Give Me Gold and this is Copper Chic they are such high quality eyeshadows and I also have uh, three single eyeshadows two of them are L'Oreal and this one is uh, one I got in my Ipsy bag it's Pop Goes the Shadow it's in Champagne and it broke when I first got it um, just a little piece off the edge broke but it's it is such a pretty color and it is um, just a really pretty champagne color and this is what it looks like you know just a regular champagne and it's so creamy and very very pigmented and that's where it is the next two are these L'Oreal infallible uh, pressed pigments and I've heard a lot of people talk about these and these were the only two that I looked appealing to me at my drugstore um, the first one is the ice latte 888 and this one is 756 always pearly pink. This is the pink one and they are so soft and pigmented. There's the pink one and here is ice latte. They are very pigmented and just such beautiful eyeshadows. Um, and so creamy and I've used the pink one and I hadn't had a chance to use the uh, iced latte yet and then I also have these um, this butter lipstick and the NYX red pencil liner I can't remember if I said this in my last favorites or if I've mentioned this before but um, it is the NYX lip liner in hot red SPL 817 And it's the perfect red for me. And then 
The lipstick is the Butter Lipstick in BLS08 Mary Jane's. And that is the lipstick. I like it because it is a blue tinted red. The next favorite is this Cody Airspun Powder. I have it in Translucent Extra Coverage 070-41 and I just absolutely love this face powder. Um, I have it, I've always used the CoverGirl one that I always use since I ever started makeup and this is the first powder that is not that and I love it. And the last favorite is this uh, L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara Shocking Extensions. Um, I have it in the brown black so the writing is that orangey coral. It's extremely small so I can get into all of my eyelash. Okay guys that's all my favorites. I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Yeah. Yeah. Don't forget to subscribe and like and I will see you guys soon. Bye!